Good evening guys, this is Sumail. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today in this video we shall learn how to import a complete 3D model of a building from SketchUp to Dialogs. Sometimes maybe you will receive a SketchUp file from your interior designer or a consultant. The file which has too many details in it. And say you are working on facade lighting or landscape lighting. Yes, of course you can make a 3d model of the building in dialogues itself but in case you can use the same 3d model of a sketchup in dialogues evo so this will save your time in making a 3d model in dialogues okay in this tutorial we'll be discussing what are the different issues you will be facing when you are trying to handle this sketchup file and what are the things you need to clear if you're working for a facade lighting design for a given building or a villa of a 3d model okay so here i have considered a sample project it is a modern villa it has too many details in it you can see there are some autocad plans there is a huge road so many objects within it like the vehicles the plants and inside too you can see some curtains and some furniture pieces too okay original file size of this sketch of file is 22 mb which is very heavy if I'm going to import the same way in the dialogues. I don't want to use very heavy 3D files in my dialogues. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to clean this file. First step is if you have any AutoCAD 2D plans on it, just select and delete. Select, delete. Okay. And the roads, select, delete. Okay. Zoom extend, zoom out. Okay. After this step, go to Windows, Model Info, Statistics, and Purge Unused. Okay, this will reduce the file size. You can repeat this step. Close now. Next thing is delete the 3D models, which is which you can easily delete in the outer side. Okay, start by deleting the 3D models which have too many polygons, because those polygons will have high mb so once you delete those things the file becomes little less heavy and you can easily operate on that file so here the first thing i'm going to delete is i'm going to delete the planter boxes because those will have heavy polygon size okay i don't need this plants i can import some of the plants if i need in the dialogues evo if not required i will not use it in case i'm focusing only on the facade lighting design done perfect or i will also delete this vehicles i don't need this okay till here it was easy to delete but there are few things which are which are inside this villa like you can see some curtains here some single and double curtains and uh, here if we see there are even some chairs so deleting one by one will take too much of time so what you have to do is go to components okay here select the drop down and choose in model okay so this will show whatever the 3d models you have in this file all those will be visible here okay all you have to do is select and delete okay then it will show you this warning it's saying that all instances will be deleted means it is not occurring once it is occurring multiple times in this project so if i delete from here then all those instances will be deleted i'm going to say okay and delete it similarly i'm going to repeat the same for this delete repeat for everything okay once you delete few of the items you can go and unpurge again window model info purge unused okay again go to this and select delete escape select delete escape select delete repeat for all
so what i'm going to do is select select and delete see i'm deleting from here and this two will get deleted if there's something left even after you clear from here then you can directly go to that thing and delete it okay now i have cleared everything the sketchup model is a solid structure of only the facade now again i'm going to window model info statistics and purge unused okay then zoom all select everything control a right mouse click and make a group okay zoom all before exporting check the units of the sketchup model window model info and units okay make sure everything is in meters if it is in millimeters or centimeters you have to change it so that the scale of the project doesn't change when you are importing it in a dialux evo okay then file export 3d model i'm exporting it in dot 3ds file because i can import the 3ds files in the dialux evo my file is exported let's check the file size this is the file properties it's just 2 mb 2.15 mb which is very very less and it took me just 10 to max 15 minutes to clear the sketch of files if i was going to make a 3d model on my own in dialogue maybe it's going to take me one or two hours or sometimes even more depending upon the complexity of the project so this way you can make use of the received sketch of files for facade or landscape projects now let's go to dialogues we'll try importing it file import furniture files and imported zoom all perfect seems perfect there are no once you import once you import it in the dialogues evo check for the missing textures okay whatever the textures are missing that will appear as black okay like this one this one and here this one okay rest all we don't have any missing textures everything seems fine okay even here this black i think i can totally delete it because i, I can make a site element in dialogues which is very easy after you check for the black surfaces go back to the, your sketchup file and delete those things i will explode this okay either if it is not important to you then you can select and delete it okay like this is not important to me because i can make a site element in dialogues but this is important to me because it is a staircase and this is this is missing this is black which is this part okay so in such case what you have to do is select double select again select so that you can see those blue surface marked with dots okay what you're going to do is right mouse click and reverse the faces okay that's it nothing else zoom all then what else was missing the back side this part okay so i'm going to back side oh there's nothing here zoom all seems perfect and we'll select again make a group window model info statistics purge unused file export 3d model okay now we'll go back to dialogues We'll, i will delete this one then i will import the new file file import furniture file and this is my file will i skip a one seems perfect now you see the one which was missing the texture it is proper now so anything which which appears black it means that the texture is missing and what you have to do is just go to the sketchup and reverse it phases even after reversing faces it doesn't work then apply some some solid texture to it okay and it will be fine 
now this is this is proper what i'm going to do is i'm just going to add some texture to it I have finished applying the textures you can see now it looks perfect you can apply the same textures from interior designers because you will be able to match render perspectives if you even your textures match with the with the received renders from a consultant okay after this what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw a rectangular floor element just as big as this 3d model I don't want to draw a very big floor element so I will make sure that it just perfectly covers okay now you can even apply some texture to this I'll make a solid black perfect now to check how this 3d model will be visible when I make some lighting concept to this and uh, to check if there are like missing lines or visible diagonal lines on the wall surfaces may i'm going to position some lighting here calculation is completed this is the effect looks perfect I'll do some of the settings like I will switch off the sky texture or you can keep it on I will keep it on I will adjust the brightness levels if required bright or lesser bright now it is in cool white I will make manual and adjust the adjust the scale so that it matches the tone you need let me keep sky texture for the black now looks perfect amazing to set the view I just made it zoom in you can do it with by holding shift minus minus okay I'll go to export save new view ray tracer increase the resolution to the maximum you can make it even FHD but I am trying with 4k ultra HD because after calculation and you know I can observe that there are no solid lines on the walls of this 3d model okay so let us make high level render start ray tracing it render is completed and it's perfect though I haven't placed some of the lights here that's why it is looking too dark but you can make a complete facade lighting concept and use and check the results one more thing if there is some visible sorted lines like this on the polygon surface of your 3d model what you can do is there are two things if you can delete if it is a small portion and you can easily make in the dialogues evo delete it and make it in the dialogues okay like this boundary wall i can easily use dialogues room elements and make it okay in case it, it is coming it is appearing on some complex walls or ceilings what you can do is apply some texture now see there are two things here there is a plain wall and here there is a texture wall okay on this plain wall those lines are very cleanly visible where else see though there is one diagonal line even here it is not much visible maybe because it's because of the texture so if you have any texture there do apply it and try to clean it up so this is how you can import the complete 3d model from sketchup to dialogues